Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a fun fashion faves video. I've done one of these videos before and I didn't get a ton of views on it, which I don't really mind. I just don't want to put out videos that you guys really don't want to see. But I checked back and a lot of the people that commented say, yeah, keep doing fun faves videos. So this one is for you guys. And I got my boy Bruce right here. Um, He's just a cutie. I have to have him in the back of these fun faves video. He's always a fun fave. So ch -ch -ch, let's get into... First thing that I'm going to talk about is um, just a couple pairs of shoes that I have. I've been really into flats and mainly like the pointed toe flats. Um, so my mom always asks me to shout her out in my videos. So mom, thank you so much for these shoes. She just bought them for me. Um, just like randomly there's hair dog hair all over them but whatever um i think she got these at ross they're um madden girl yeah madden girl and i think they're so cute and they look like the inside you guys see it i think it's really cute they're super stylish um i've worn them to work a couple times and everybody loves them so i've been really liking these and i wore them the uh, one time i wore them i wore the shoes i wore gray pants a royal blue shirt and then a necklace that i'm going to show you um so i love them absolutely love them they're one of my faves and then um at forever 21 i picked up these nude flats um i really like these two they're already dirty <laughs> I know I can't keep anything clean, but these are super sleek. They just look really clean and fresh. So I like these a lot. And these were about $15, I think. Not too bad, but um, I have to figure out how to clean them because they're dirty. Ugh. But yeah, I've been loving the flats. Pointed toe. I think they just look really crisp and I don't know, it just kind of brings the whole outfit together. So moving on to some jewelry items, which is still part of fashion. Um, Bobble Bar has been one of my favorite stores, hands down. I got a ton of things, not a ton, but I got two necklaces on Black Friday and um, I bought, I have three pairs of their earrings. I love them so much. The designs are just so unique and crisp and on point. So um, the necklace that I wore with the blue shoes and um, the blue top is this guy right here like seriously look how pretty this is it's so it looks really rich and luxur ugh, luxurious um I don't know like it does not look like a cheap necklace whatsoever and it's just so pretty and like timeless it's a timeless piece so I've been loving that necklace and then the two earrings that I've been crazy about I wore these in a couple of my last videos I mean I filmed three videos in one day that day so these I wore three different videos but they're these blue guys right here the gems are so pretty the design is on point I love them they're really big I wouldn't wear these like on a daily basis but when I want to wear I don't I don't know when I want to fancy up a little bit I'll wear these and then ones that are just more wearable ones that are more wearable um, are these so like diamond teardrop ones and I wear these all the time to work too and people are like I love those earrings like people love my jewelry I'm like it's bobblebar.com um, but they're so pretty very wearable you can wear them with anything obviously if they're wearable but those were the three jewelry pieces that I've been liking from Bobble Bar. And then the last kind of jewelry piece is by Michael Kors. I got this for Christmas, and it's just the rose gold watch. And this watch is the only one that I have that has the Roman numerals on it. And at first I didn't really like that style, but now I love it. Um, so I've been wearing this a lot lately. I will leave the link to this watch down below if you are interested. But um, it's by far my favorite rose gold watch. I have one by Fossil, but this one just looks a little bit more expensive. I know Fossil makes Michael Kors watches, but... Like, Fossil doesn't have anything like this. I would totally buy one from Fossil, but they just don't. Um, so pretty and crisp. It looks really nice. I think I've said crisp, like, ten times in this video, so I'm gonna stop. So, I think that's pretty much it for fashion. Moving along to... Oh, Mom, I'm mentioning you twice in this video. I know, it's crazy. But for Christmas, she got me this, like, brush slash lipstick slash makeup organizer, I guess. My dog will not shut up up that's this is what she does all day if you guys can hear her she's been barking um okay so my mom got me this little organizer for christmas i think she got it at ross i'll show you a separate clip because it's kind of hard to tell like while i'm holding it but um i have all my brushes here on the two sides and then um there's like a little lipstick tray which i actually keep two of real techniques brushes in there and then i have a couple of compartments down um on the base and i just keep my sponges whatever foundation that i've been using and then that's pretty much it first I didn't know if I really liked it that much just because I felt like I lost a lot of brush space but um, not really I mean all my brushes still fit I also have to clean out some of my brushes because some of them I do not use but it's a little bit of a tight fit but I do like that I can store my lip uh, lipsticks and my sponges and all my foundations and stuff like that so 
loving that piece um if you can find it at ross totally go for it and buy it i don't know ross is so hit and miss so is like tj maxx and marshall's so good luck if you want to buy that Onto two of my current favorite mugs. This one is from Target. I got this a pretty long time ago. Kind of matches with my nail polish. Um, I love this mug so much. It's just so pretty. It has a little K inside as well. Fits. It, it's actually a really big mug. I mean, it kind of looks little, but it's pretty big. Um, really pretty. I love the color. It was perfect when I saw it. And these were like $4.99. I think they're on sale now. I think they're just trying to get rid of them. So try and find your letter at Target. And then one that I got from Christmas, uh, for Christmas from my my sister is this one and this is my travel coffee mug I take this pretty much every day to work or whenever I do bring my coffee to work I take this it says big boss because I am a big boss I'm kcab the boss uh, that's my personal Instagram you guys are welcome to follow it so big boss I love this mug when people see it they're like okay Katie okay but I don't really know where she got it from hopefully she will leave it leave where she got it from down below in the comments her name is Trina and yeah so Trina C comment down below where'd you get this and then once she tells me I will put it in the description box also from Trina for Christmas she got me this Erin Condren life planner <sighs> planning is so addicting and I I love this I love this guy right here this is actually uh, just a temporary cover I bought the cover online um, it's a mint cover with like little scales I love it but I just wanted to show it to you because seriously this is the cutest planner ever and because it's so cute it makes you want to plan like for a while I would buy planners and then I would just stop because my camera just stopped recording so I don't really know where I stopped talking but I'm gonna show you what I've done so far it's not super crazy um, because I'm still getting the hang of it but that's kind of what I have so far like oh and she also got me stickers from Scribble Prince Co which I'll leave down below she also has a YouTube channel Andrea Marie I've um I think I've I, I did like a holiday collab with her she's super cool I'll leave her Etsy page down below but like on Tuesday morning I got a Starbucks coffee and um like this day I planned um I probably paid a bill there's a dollar sign I pretty I probably paid one of my bills payday on Thursday and I just have like you know whatever I'm doing that day here are my goals and notes all kind of YouTube related so that's what I've done so far it's not super duper crazy but um, I'm getting there guys so Erin Condren life planner I love it um, one last no yeah, one last thing. Um, my YouTuber kind of favorite person right now is Butt First Coffee. Her name is Callie. She's so, I don't know, she's so funny. She has that like dry, sarcastic kind of humor and I just love her videos. She does like the battle of primers, mascara videos that are super uh, helpful and informative. Um, check her out. I really like her videos and I think you guys will like her too. So that's pretty much it. Um, those are all of my fun fashion faves. I feel like if I say fun fashion faves, it's like all about fashion. But these are just fashion favorites, fun favorites, and just random favorites. So thank you guys all for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.